red, white, and blue, depending on the color you're looking for. I hope this product is right for you. It's the Extras Wireless Digital Clock. Count up, count down, alarm clock that shows the weather in Celsius or Fahrenheit, as well as the date and the time. It is not a remote control wireless clock, but it will go on to a smartphone with the configuration of 192.168.88.1. For some, it may be quite difficult, but for some, it may be so easy to hook up. I'll do my best to show you how to set the clock up and let's get going. You don't need a smartphone. You can simply set it up and use it for classrooms, offices, you name it, or just have a beautiful clock hanging on the wall. A level, anchors, screws are not included. This is a template. You place on the wall, you put some tape, drill two holes. On the back of the unit, you have your keyholes. You simply close the kickstand, lock it into place. This is your temperature sensor. Your remote sensor can be located, if this has one, anywhere inside the unit. These are the controls. Snooze, set, 24, 12 hour military time. Timer minimum. Timer set and timer. These two are the ones you press together to fully reset the clock back to 12 o'clock. And these two will reset the timer, the count up and down. This here is the door that opens up. Your power, any extra cord you want to tuck in, you can do so in closing up and dressing down here. Down over here is a high, auto, and low. So when it gets dark, it adjusts. It may adjust at a certain hour of the actual clock. And then your speaker over here. Your kickstand. Open and sit. Six foot wingspan at six feet plus right here. Find a power source. As you plug in, the clock is automatically set up at default. We're going to pull the power, hold both buttons down. Fully reset the unit again. 1-1, one, one, Friday, 12 o'clock. We are going to open up the settings. Go to Wi-Fi. We're looking for HQX2128. Connecting to the unsecured network. Opening up any browser. And typing in 192.168.88.1. 192.168.88.1. Web configuration. As we hit web configuration. It will ask you to sign in, Wi-Fi SSID, password, and it's going to ask for a time zone. We are in Eastern Standard Time. That will be negative five. You're going to have to increase until you get to your correct zone. So if you were in Pacific Time, you would be in number two or three. 
you'd be two hours difference, one hour's difference. So I'm not in O3, I'm in negative five. I'm looking for my Wi-Fi. I'm all correct and I'm ready to set up. It would say success and within a couple of seconds, it's going to adjust to 803. I'm going to close down. And we are now in the correct time. If you stay on the page, it's only going to stay there. We are 100% Wi-Fi set up. So every time you take this product, and we're going to lose power, We're going to set back up. And we're going to reset to Wi-Fi. If I don't want Celsius on the back of the product, it's probably the third button up. Right over here. Changing Celsius and Fahrenheit. If I press the very top button, the second button, I go through the process of the unit to set up. The button below, German, French, Italian, NET, Espanol, Denmark, English. And that's previous, which is these buttons, next, up, and previous. This is set. Daylight savings time in the on, 2022, 7, 17, 8, 05, and back. If I want an alarm to set, alarm 1. I'm hitting over here. If I want a timer, I hit the timer and I want to now go to the ups and downs. You can see me changing the time. Now I'm going to hit one of the buttons and we are counting down. I hit over here. An hour and one minute we will be finishing this video review. I hit one, I hit two, or I hit both. It's a little tricky. You got to hit both at the same time, dead center of the actual unit. I did not show placing in additional cord and closing up. We are 100% completed in the review. You have a manual. All this information is pretty clear in the manual on how to use the product. I hope I made this video as clear as possible to help you out in setting up your wireless clock. Please forgive any flicker because of the camera. I hope you enjoy your product if you decide this is right for you.